How's it going everyone and welcome to my new barracks room. It's uh, it's pretty good, it's pretty decent for what it is. Um, I'm gonna give you guys a quick tour of how your barracks room will look like at JBLM. I know there's you know the Air Force side and the Army side and there's North Fort which I think have the best barracks in all of JBLM. I think ours is pretty is um is second and then third, fourth, you know, and so on and so forth. But but let me give you guys a room tour of what you guys can expect at JBLM. Hopefully you get one of these rooms. If not, then good luck. I know like one, two and two, two, they don't really have the best barracks. But luckily for me, I got really good barracks and I'm glad I did. Starting off here, you have the door entrance and you have all this cabinet space, which is amazing. Um, sorry about this. I still need to wash it because the person that was here before did leave all their stuff. And the person that was here before did leave this as well. So I have plates, I have cups. And then moving on, sorry about the trash, I'm still cleaning. You do have your own uh, stove, top and oven, which is great. You have your own microwave, refrigerator, and you have your own washer and dryer combo, which is amazing inside your own room, which is incredible. Moving on here, you know, you got your bathroom or whatnot. And then you have a simple, simple layout for the sink. The bathroom is pretty cool. Pretty standard, standard. It's uh, it's decent for what it is, honestly. Then stepping out of the bathroom, you have the common area. So this is it. It's just one circular table. You have both rooms right there. And luckily for me, I do not have a roommate, so there's no one in that room. And I'm really glad because just like in Young Sun, just like at Camp Humphreys, I am by myself in this large room and it's awesome. Maybe I'll get a roommate in the near future, but I do plan on moving out of the barracks relatively soon. So wish me luck on that. So let me give you a tour of my room real quick. And it's, it's pretty decent for what I have it set out to be. I'm not staying here for a long time because I am, like I said, moving out of the barracks, hopefully in the month or two, we'll see how, how fast they can get things done, you know, admin wise. So I'll show you guys my barracks room real quick. So I'm entering my barracks room. I do have lights posted up here. I do have my stuff from Korea right here. Look at that, my awards, all my, all my little trinkets. This little guy I got from Japan, which is really awesome. I really like him. Some soundproof panels. I have some more at home, but I have yet to actually take them with me. You guys remember the legendary fan that brought, this is my bed. And I did bring this blanket from home. Shout out to my mom, love it. Uh, this set came with a, a pillow, pillowcase, and I think it looks pretty good, pretty decent. I did like it out of the other options because there is a reversible side to kind of like this red color. So I really like that. It only cost me about 35 bucks for the whole set. Not too bad, not too bad. Then you have, of course, the classic American flag right there. Um, since this bed is pretty high, uh, I didn't want to, you know, have to put my phone right here and then like reach over when I'm, you know, wake up in the morning to get my phone. So I need something a little bit taller and I didn't want to leave, I didn't want to put this on top of that because I like the way this looks. And maybe I'll get a TV here, maybe not, but yeah, I had, to, <laughs> I had to use this box from household goods that they, my stuff came in. So as of right now, it's just my two cases and my AirPods charging with the MagSafe, you know, that's really nice. It's really cool. Uh, I do have a tough box down there and on top is another blanket with my tripod and this classic backpack that I have. So it's amazing. This is my setup right now. It's my 32 inch TV with my MacBook Air. So it's, uh, looks pretty good for what it is, honestly. Nothing too, nothing too like fancy or whatnot, but up here is where the good stuff is. My sunglasses, my glasses, my Canon Rebel SL1, my Nikon S9900, which is my first camera. Right, then it was this camera. Then it was this camera. So I really like the three that I have here. This one is good. 
especially with this lens. Here's my iPad right here and my little um, camera bag that I have. But this lens is really great with this lens because it's this kit, it's the kit lens, which is, it's decent, it's, uh, what is it? 15, 18 to 55 millimeter. It's what my phone has right now, so <laughs> it's nothing too, too, too amazing. But I do have another lens. I think it's about 75 to 300 millimeter and that's back at home, but it goes, it pairs well with this one, especially here at JBLM where nature is a big thing. I do want to get those uh, far away shots of creatures and animals and whatnot. So it's pretty awesome. And then moving in here, we have the closet. Well, let's turn on the light. And here we go. The closet's not too bad. Uh, there were these pins here early before, so I kind of just took advantage and hung my two PCs, my umbrella, uh, my towel here for some reason. I have my uniforms up there, some hats, and some other clothes. I'm leaving this space open for my CIF gear. I have my TA50 right there, some other stuff, some other clothes. Yeah, I'm just putting majority of stuff right here, and because I'm not because I'm gonna leave in like in a month or two, I'm not unpacking everything out of here. I still have a couple of things left and some extra shoes right there. So yeah, that's pretty much my room setup for JBLM. It's uh, pretty nice actually, not gonna lie. I do love having my own washer and dryer inside my barracks room because that's like a game changer for me. I really like that. That's like top notch because I know certain uh, bases and certain barracks it's like a shared uh, space, the laundry room. I know at Humphreys it was, but we did have newer appliances there at Humphreys, which is really nice. But I know at the reception barracks, there were only like two washers that worked and like one dryer that worked well. So <sighs> take it or leave it guys, but I'm really glad I have this washer and dryer combo in my unit, which is amazing. But I hope you guys liked the video. I would show you guys outside, but it's like 8.42 p.m. right now, and it's pretty dark, and my window is facing another building, like another wall of a building. But yeah, I'm really glad I got this spot. Hopefully, hopefully, my leave gets approved from March. I do start in processing the unit next week, so I go to Brigade and do all that stuff, and that's when I'll, um, I'll go through IPS-A and you know request my leave because, because we no longer do the DA-31 forms. In person we had to do it through ipsa a and that website is very buggy so fingers crossed fingers crossed honestly but anyways guys i hope you liked the video and i'll catch you guys later when i tell you how my first week was i don't know anyways guys be safe have fun be awesome